Namaskar, namaste, apkese, guys. Welcome to another episode of uh, Corona Cooking with Jin Wow. <laughs> Uh, so in the light of Diwali, Dibavali, no pun intended. Yeah, right inside, no, no, no kueba. No. no. Uh, today we're gonna make some food no power pula, pulao rice, pulao rice. Pulao so, rice. No, so no. Uh, here we go. Here are the ingredients you need for making pulao rice. Let's go through them. This is a bunch of uh, garlic ginger paste. Some garlic ginger paste finely chopped. You can also um, uh, blend them in a blender to get this, or you finely chop them. Some potatoes, diced, onions, um, capsicums, sweet corn, baby corns, baby corns. So, so this is actually my second time doing the pulao rice. The first time I did it, um, I followed the recipe online and I, I did it according to the instructions to the tea everything, every ingredients but this is my second time doing it I'm trying to modify with uh, the kind of vegetables you add in today I'm trying to modify it with baby corns uh, and today I'm doing a special pulao rice which is a beetroot pulao rice so beetroot is the main ingredient in fact um, I like to use beetroot in cooking quite a bit of vegetarian or vegan food because I see like the meat, I see like the meat of uh, vegan food, so this is a good substitute for meat, I feel, and it's just fucking healthy, so it's good. Some green chili, uh, sleep with the seeds removed, I'm adding carrots as well, um, coriander finely chopped, I'm missing mint this time because I don't have mint with me but I don't think it makes too much of a big difference. <coughs> Spices, always important in uh, Indian cuisine. Bay leaves, cinnamon, maize, stanis, cardamom, green cardamoms, cloves, and cumin seeds. Oh, by the way, I'm making pulao rice. So you need rice as well, no? The rice is uh, um, basmatic rice. We've got to soak the basmatic rice beforehand, so for at least about 20 to 40 minutes. Um, make sure you rinse the rice at least two or three times until the water runs clear. And soak them for 20 to 40 minutes. And um, basmatic rice for cooking beetroot pulao rice. Alright, step one. So here we got some ghee. I like to add some ghee when I'm over cooking Indian food. So you got ghee and some vegetable oil on the pan. Turn off the heat and let's go. And then you need some Prosecco for entertainment. So once you get the oil going, make sure it's a bit hot. You see the ghee is now a little bit melted. These are the spices that we have seen before you get them in ba -ba 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 -ba. actually it's nice to have the cinnamon a bit split up get the smell going and there we go step one make sure you keep stirring the spices so you don't burn them once you smell that most of it is going pretty well, we're gonna add in the onions and the green chili. A bit of introduction of the crew in the house. We've got the mi padre and mi madre. Tranquilo. <laughs> then we go the onions. Let the onions go in. It's a bit hot now, lower the heat. Next we got the chili, the chili goes in, what's Indian food without chili eh? You got chili going in, and then now we get it mixed up, go go go! Next to go in is the um, garlic ginger paste, this is the ginger and garlic paste, you can see them, yeah, can you see me? Yeah. Mm 
We need to cook the garlic ginger paste until the raw smell of the ginger and the garlic is um, it's not there and you only smell the fragrance of this freaking food power Pachamama ingredient gifted to mankind for mankind to fulfill our dharma in life food power and then you drink some Prosecco to even enhance the smell you know food power Prosecco mm. next you add in the beetroot carrots potatoes capsicums basically everything and Sort it down to fragrant. Go, go, go! Full power, vamos, vamos! The one thing about cooking when you're high, you know, you might misjudge sometimes when you add certain ingredients, but at the same time, you might just do them so fucking well that it turns out to be fucking full power. <laughs> Curcum, curcuma, curcuma porvo. Este es de, de Ecuador. This is from Ecuador. I got it from my travels. Um, Turmeric. These veggies look almost ready to go into the pot for cooking the rice. Next, you're gonna add this drained rice. This is the drained basmatic rice that we soaked earlier. Right into this. And then you're gonna add some water. I added a bit of salt to the water. The water has to stay salty enough. So I've added about one and a bit more teaspoon of uh, salt. Sal, sal. You know this is Jin Wao, uh, idiot, so un idiota. So if you want me to give you the exact measurement of how much water, I don't really know. It's just basically by feeling. Uh, maybe you can see from here. Uh, it's about like this the rice I use one and a half cup of basmatic rice and this time I use a bit more vegetables vegetables also produce some water when you cook them so I think this is good enough hopefully the rice will not be too wet like the last time and all you need to do now is to put them into this rice cooker and cook them while you wash the dishes <laughs> and here we go cooking rice Full power beetroot pulao rice. Guys, this is full power. <laughs> perfecto, perfecto. Happy Diwali, happy Diwali. Power, full power, full power. <laughs> Hola. ¿Cómo estás? ¿Qué tal? Namaskar. Salam alaikum. <laughs> this is the end of video, Jin Wow. Just want to thank you for watching the video. If you like the video, you know what to do. <laughs> stick that stick straight in your asshole <laughs> and hit that like button right below, my friend. That's right. Like and subscribe. Ba -ba -ba -ba.